I'm going for it. I'm going for the master bolt here. All right, we're going to be battling Joey. Um, looking at his team, looking at his team, I think what I want to do is lead off with the... I don't know. Do I really want to do that? Do I really want to do? I mean, it doesn't really matter if I bring in the Galarian Weezing right now and neutralizing gas affects Venomoth because Venomoth has tinted lens. And I still have to set up for like one turn. I mean, looking at his team, if I was him, what would I want to do? What would I want to do? I mean, he can bring a DD. Yeah, I mean, if I was him, I'd probably bring the DD. I'm gonna bring Venomoth and then the Mian Chao because I want to wide guard to block the expanding force that's gonna be coming out. Um, uh, what else do I bring? What else do I bring? Maybe Vaporeon. Maybe Vaporeon. Yeah, I bring Vaporeon. Vaporeon will do pretty good against Chien Pao because then we can just baby it all eyes. Uh, we can baby it all eyes the Dragonite and we can go for Icy Wind and we can go for Chilling Water to weaken their attackers. So, okay. Let's just see how this all turns out. Okay. Okay. Um, mm, mm. Okay. I do not like this at all. Mm. I could put him to sleep. You know, actually, no. I don't know, because, like, if I go, if I read this wrong, if I fake out and then he switches into Ndidi, I'm screwed. Right? But... Yeah, if I fake out and he switches into the DD, I'm screwed. However, if I call this wrong, I just gotta pray he doesn't switch into the DD. Okay, he doesn't. Let me just put this to sleep. Weak armor? I don't care. If I can put you to sleep, none of this matters. If I can put you to sleep, none of this matters. Why are you doing this? Bro, I'm just a moth, bro. Oh my god! I'm just a moth, man. What is your problem? Alright. Okay, so, uh... Good news, bad news, right? Bad news, we made this thing faster. Good news. There is no good news. I am probably going to go for wide guard. I'm going to go for wide guard and I'm just going to go for haze. He endures. I'm not giving you another speed boost, buddy. In fact, I'm shutting it down right now. There's no more speed boost. All right, you're going home. Oh. Oh, my. That's amazing. You got all of these boosts. And the sad thing is, none of them are going to matter. I just need to know. Will my ability, Mirror Herb, activate after the haze or before the haze? Because if this activates after, I mean, before the haze, I'm screwed. And there's no point to any of this. If it activates after the haze, then great. I get all these speed boosts and I get the weakness policy boost. You have oh please reset everything but me please please vaporeon don't do this to me he has to be having a heart attack right now he has to be having a heart attack if i was him i would have a heart attack if i just saw my opponent invalidate my entire strategy and then steal my boost i'd be terrified I think I'm just going to go for a Drain Punch, and I'm going to go for a Icy Wind. 
I don't think you can click endure again. You can't click endure again. You won't. Yeah, he withdrew because he saw how pointless it was. Nine tails. Oh. Okay. I mean, this just weakens your water type or Shifu, or rapid striker Shifu. And yeah, you're doing all of this damage, but I'm just gonna drain punch and get my health back, so. Yeah, that's fun. Yo. Hey, Braid Star 99, how's it going? And we get the Icy win on the Urshifu and onto the Ninetales. I don't really care about being in a drought. In fact, I might double down and punch. I might be able to pick up a KO on the Urshifu with the Mian Chao. Which is crazy, because I like Mian Chao, it's just... I don't really use Mian Chao offensively. Even though I really have wanted to, from the very moment it was first introduced. Oh, okay? Hmm. Hmm. Was he Choice Scarf? Yeah, you live this, you live this, you got this. Easy. Easy. We eat those. We eat those. There we go. Never thought I'd see the day I actually pick up a KO with me and Chow. Especially on her Shifu. He goes for Solar Beam. Don't do this. I am max defensive investments into this. Yeah. Like, that's cute. Like, I am max defense investments on this bad boy, all right? I have Regenerator on me and Shao too, so we know that we're faster than the Ninetales. I know for a fact that I am faster than the Armor Rogue. I could go for a U-turn into the Armor Rogue and then get the Regenerator help. Okay. Okay, we're just not gonna do that then, I guess. We're, we're just not gonna have fun. I'm just gonna go for... I'm gonna go for nothing. Like, I mean, if I hit the Icy Wind, I'm just gonna make him faster. If he sets up Trick Room. Nah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. I don't have to worry about these things. I don't have to worry about these things. I'm gonna double into it. Look at that damage. I wish he would set up a trick room. I wish he would. You won't. Not when I have Skeledurge. You won't. He goes for Solar Beam. I'm trying to tell you, my Vaporeon's bulky. It cannot die. Okay, I'm, I'm willing to actually consider that it could die. Oh, he doesn't go for Trick Room. That's weird. That's very weird. Mm. Well, I'm just gonna go for Icy Wind and... I'm gonna go for Torch Song into the Ndidi. We already know that the Armor Rouge has weak armor, so I don't have to worry about boosting its attack or boosting its special attack by hitting it with a fire type move like Ninetales. Flash Fire is an interesting ability, except nobody's gonna activate it. Never in my life have I seen anybody activate flash fire and a weather ball is not going to do anything to me because i'm an assault vested skeleton so none of this matters
we do pick up the KO on the Ndidi and we get a special attack boost. So Skeledurn is cooking, all right? Skeletor has been my favorite starter for this entire game, all right? <laughs> Ever since I saw the evolutions for everything, I knew Skeletor was it. Because, I'm gonna be honest with you, it definitely wasn't gonna be Quackable. Because I thought Quackable was gonna be like a bulky bodybuilder, sailor type Pokemon with like a similar body type to incineroar or machamp or macho you know but that wasn't the case so i'm just a little disappointed actually i can go for wide guard right i'm gonna be a dick and i'm gonna go for wide guard but yeah so i, I just didn't like quackable quackable was just was not it And then I saw, what was it, Sprigatito? Okay, he picks up the KO on the Mian I, I, I called that wrong. But I'm gonna go for an Earth Power into the Nine Tails. So now it's just gonna come down to me and Armor Roche, and I have an Assault Vest, so. I'm not really too afraid of how this is gonna go. I can just click Snarl, actually. I just wanna be safe, I'm gonna click Shadow Ball. Oh, we live it! Oh man, that Assault Vest. That Assault Vest. That Assault Vest came in at the end. God, man. You gotta love that assault vest. And then I gotta work on team building. I, it's just one of those things where it's just like, I know what I need to do. I just don't wanna take the time out to do it. So like, I could sit down and watch a video about team building. Can I be? Rudu, aren't you already in the server? All right, we're gonna be battling Martyr. They have a King Gambit, an Iron Hands, a Flutter Mane, a Torkoal. A palmet and a dragonite. Okay. Okay. That's uh that's gonna be quite the fight. He's really gotta look at this team. Hmm. I think I'm gonna bring out I want to bring out Ogre Pollen, but I'm going to bring out Venomoth and Mian Xiao. And we can bring Skeledurge in the back. Actually, no, no, no. This is what we're going to do. Glaren Weezing and Mian Xiao because I want to shut down any drought. Activating the protosynthesis. If I can shut down protosynthesis before it gets going, that would be really good. And then I bring Ogapone in the back to deal with the Torkoal and the Dragonite. And maybe Vaporeon. Venomoth would be so good here. Just tank an eruption. That's if. If. I'd say just mess around in Pokemon Showdown so you don't need to worry about training in-game to test things out. Alright. Like, I do have Pokemon Showdown installed on this laptop. Catch two hands? Oh god, don't. I don't think I like those. I don't think I like those names. I... I don't know. I don't know. I'm not gonna catch two hands. I'm not gonna catch two hands today, buddy. I'm gonna go for strain steam into iron hands. If I was them, you're definitely not staying in on the Mian Chao unless you're terrestrializing. Okay, Terra's bug. Okay. 
I mean, well, we have heat waves, so we can do that. AK fakes me out. That's all right. There we go. Decent damage with the strange steam. And we eat an iron head, so we're good. We're good. We're good. I can go for a U-turn here, and I can go for a heat wave. Hmm. That does nothing. I'm just worried if I call this wrong, he's going to drain punch me and he's going to get so much health back and that's going to piss me off. Get the burn. All right, all right, great, 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 great. All right, I can just Terra here and I can go for this. I can go for an Ivy Kujul into the King Gambit and I can go for a Strange Steam into the Iron Hand. We're also going to get a defense boost onto the Cornerstone Mass Ogre Palm. I just love Cornerstone Mass. Its design is so good. Okay, protects. Coward. We pick up the KO on Iron Hands. That's good, that's good, that's good. I'm just worried, cause like, um, the Flutter Mane is probably there. I like turtles. Okay. Ivy Kujul, actually, no. Ivy Kujul into the Torkoal. Ivy Kujul into the Torkoal. Oh, Torkoal survived. Okay, Ogre Pwn got switched out. No! I mean, I guess this works. I guess this works. We do pick up the KO on the Torkoal. Oh, thank God. That's crazy. But we do lose the Mian Shao. That's unfortunate because the Mian Shao is the protection against a Dazzling Gleam. Oh, man. I mean, I can bring in Vaporeon. It's not the end of the world. Vaporeon can live a Dazzling Gleam. Okay, it's Palmet. Okay, that's that's a whole different story. <laughs> that's a whole different story. Let's talk about this. Let's just talk about this, all right? I can go for, oh no, what do I want to go for? I can go for a heat wave. He goes for a revival blessing. Okay. I mean, whatever he brings back is only going to be half health. I can, I think I can do this. Only way I see us losing this is if we miss the Icy Wind. 
Okay, he brings in Iron Hands. All right, we get the speed drop on Palmet. I know he has Defiant. Oh, wait, no, he doesn't because of neutralizing gas. All right, so we pick up the KO there. And we get a crit on the Palmet, so that's really good. That's really good. That's really good. We're slowly recovering health with this Galarian Weezing too, so like, it's, 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 it's getting there. It's getting there. It's getting there. I think what I want to do is I want to go for Baby Doll Eyes into Palmet, and I want to go for Strange Steam into Iron Hands. This should be a W, I believe. We just got to take it turn by turn. I mean, how many L's have we taken in this stream alone? All right. And it's all because I got a little bit too cocky. I thought I won it. And I was... All right, the fake out. Okay. Double shock. He took out the Vaporeon. Why? <laughs> Why not just focus on... Why not just focus on the Galarian Weezing? I have strange steam, buddy. Like, that's what you should be afraid of. Look at how much health we recovered. I mean, Galarian Weezing should have been out of this game a long time ago. A long time ago. Now I go for Horn Leech and I go for Strange Steam and that should be a dub. Oh man. Let's go. Guys, that was that was so close. I mean, yeah, it was close. It was close. If Martyr actually attacked the Galarian Weezing instead, he probably could have won. It's just like you know that you outspeed the Galarian Weezing. You know that the Galarian Weezing is shutting down all of the abilities on the field. You know the Galarian Weezing can hit you for super effective stab damage. Why are you not taking it out? Controversy going on in the uh, Pokemon VGC Championships where people were actually getting eliminated because they had Hackmons or they had Gen Pokemon. So like everything I do, all of my teams, most of my teams, I have caught these Pokemon myself. I have bred them, I have trained them, and that's one of the reasons I like the teams that I make. It's not necessarily because they're meta or that they're viable, it's because I've actually took the time out to build that team myself and train those Pokemon myself. Back, went to the bank. Toasty, why don't you just give me some bits, bro? If you went to the bank, why don't you just share the bread with the rest of us? I'm going to bring a Galarian Weezing because I feel like we match up pretty well against the Iron Hands. We match up pretty well against the Club Fairy. And I'm probably going to bring Vaporeon honestly and then i could bring the skeledurge i'm gonna bring ogre pawn and skeledurge i want to bring the ogre pawn mainly to bait them into fighting type attacks like drain punch or close combat and then switch into skeledurge to be honest, the only hack check at regionals, but it definitely is fun to have a team you make yourself. <sighs> yeah, when you make a team yourself and you build the team, you build the sets, it's really fun. All right, we have neutralizing gas and that's really good. So we can go for a, I can go for a, I don't know, do I want to go for a strange steam here? Yeah, I want to go for a strange steam and I want to go for a baby doll eyes. He's not going to stay in. Okay. There's that. 
like and sub for attention. Hmm. Yeah, uh, how about no? Throat spray. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, I got all those boosts. That's crazy. I got all those boosts. Oh, wow. Thank you for the boost, buddy. That's crazy. I'm going to go for Aromatic Miss into Vaporeon. I, I, I'm, I'm setting this up. I'm setting up the Vaporeon. The Vaporeon is going to be the win condition here, okay? We got all of these boosts. I'm not going to let these boosts go to waste. I'm not going to let these boosts go to waste. I'm not. He goes for clanging scales. That does nothing to me. That does nothing to me. That does nothing to me. And we get the special defense boost. I'm going to set up another one. Actually, I think we're good. Uh, let me just not be greedy. Let me just not be greedy here. Let me just not be greedy. Like, congratulations. He protects with the coma. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. You actually think this matters. You actually think this matters at this point. goes for heal pulse but he protected himself that's the thing buddy that's the thing about heal pulse it's garbage it's garbaggio okay i feel like healing moves should get through protect why do i have to open myself up to an attack in order to receive heals if i'm protecting he canceled if i'm protecting i should be able to literally heal myself without worrying about it being blocked by the protect i'm telling you i'm telling you guys i made this vaporeon myself i put my heart and my soul into this vaporeon i looked at what was meta at the time and i said i'm gonna make this vaporeon viable and how did i do it water absorb vaporeon baby doll eyes to lower the attack stat of physical attackers Icy wind to slow things down, chilling water for stab water type moves that hit specially, but also still lowers the attack stat. And also because Scald isn't a thing anymore, except on certain Pokemon. And then we have the normal Terra type, but we also have the Mirror Herb. So if you have somebody that's setting up like he did with Clanging Scales or Clangorous Soul or whatever, then you literally copy all of those stat boosts. We copied every single one of them. Then we copied the throat spray special attack boost. Then we started slowing him down. And then he he knew that he had set up a monster. We went for aromatic mist to boost our special defense even further, making ourselves a tank. And then he tries to protect, he tries to heal himself, it fails. Oh, Vaporeon's disgusting. Just just take